Liverpool could make second move for Anthony Gordon. There are a number of reasons why Liverpool have chosen not to enter the market so far this summer. The main one is surely the ongoing international tournaments in Europe and the USA. Slot's recent arrival is another relevant point. The Dutchman only began work at the AXA training center last week, after all. The third rationale for things being unusually slow is that Liverpool, and other clubs, may have been waiting for Sunday's deadline to put pressure on those in need of making sales. One of the teams who are having the most difficulty following the rules is Newcastle United. Following their Saudi Arabian sponsored takeover in 2022, Newcastle have been spending freely. Part of their spree was to bring in Anthony Gordon from Everton for £45 million in January 2023. With penalties now a real possibility for the Magpies though, they've reportedly reached out to Liverpool to make a deal for Gordon. With Newcastle seemingly keen to include Jarrell Kwanzaa in any possible transfer, Liverpool said no. However, according to The Guardian, the Reds do remain interested in bringing Gordon to Anfield. They claim that a transfer for the 23-year-old was not outright dismissed by Newcastle, with Paris Saint-Germain also said to be interested. Although Liverpool reportedly did not follow up the talks with a formal offer for Gordon, there is still said to be a chance that the Reds come in again before Sunday. How likely are Liverpool to get Anthony Gordon? If Liverpool do make a second approach to take Gordon from Newcastle, then it will surely exclude any negotiation for Kwanzaa. Given their situation, the Magpies are not in a particularly strong negotiating position. If they still have to make a sale by Sunday, then Liverpool might feel emboldened to make a cash-only offer. Despite that, it has been claimed that Gordon joining Liverpool is still unlikely to happen. Aside from any issue, Liverpool could make second move for Anthony Gordon. There are a number of reasons why Liverpool have chosen not to enter the market so far this summer. The main one is surely the ongoing international tournaments in Europe and the USA.